And as you know, Dr. Fauci, there have been increasing calls now for a ban on anyone traveling from West Africa here into the United States. I know you and the president have spoken out against that. You say it could be counterproductive, could encourage people to go around uh, traditional pathways. But when you look at Africa, and we have a map up here showing where countries that have put up travel restrictions, you have seen that they've been able so far at least to isolate uh, Ebola to those three countries, Guinea, Sierra Leone, and Liberia. So if it was working in Africa, why wouldn't it work here in the United States? Well, George, I, I think one needs to understand that, that people who say that, we respect that opinion and we understand that there's some rationale for that. But would you look at what the possible side bad effects would be in the sense of counterproductive, is that when people come in from a country, it's much easier to track them if you know where they're coming from. But what you do if you then completely ban travel, there's the feasibility of going to other countries where we don't have a travel ban and have people come in. The most important thing we want to do is to protect the American public. And we'll discuss any way, and the president has said that, we'll discuss any way we need to do that. So we feel this way, but we certainly respect the opinion of people who do not, and we try to give them the rationale why we feel this way.